Hello, boys and girls. My name is Liberal James, and I'm back to share with you information about my new electric car. I'm real excited about my electric car because I'm Liberal James, and I'm helping the environment, ladies and gentlemen, by charging my car up at the charging station, which is hooked up to the coal power plant in my city. I'm Liberal James. Ladies and gentlemen, as Liberal James talks to you, I want you to know that you should have a hammer inside of your car if you're going to drive around in an electric vehicle. Now, you may be saying to yourself, Liberal James, what are you talking about, Liberal James? I'm just going to show you some of the many dangers of riding around in those fancy electric vehicles because you so fancy and you so up to date on your technology you don't need no gasoline honey child you don't need no gasoline you fancy let's see what happens when people be riding around in them electric vehicles this is out there in china watch what happened in china oh yeah we just moving along uh oh uh oh oh hell we hit a loose brick what what Okay. What? Get 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 a purse. Yeah 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 yeah. That's what happened in electric vehicle. You puncture that battery, boy. You got a problem. It's so much of a problem. Look at it. Whole car on fire. Now had he not taken her out of there, she would have been roasted chop suey. Is what his lady would have been. Chop suey. You know what I'm saying? But no. Watch this. Watch this. Watch this. Watch this. Watch this. The whole factory. <laughs> it's funny to me. So I've seen these trucks, these Riviera trucks. And first of all, uh, I don't even think that's how Rivian, Rivian trucks. I think they're beautiful. I mean, if it was a gasoline guzzling machine, man, I would go buy one today. I would because it's a write off for me. Get to write off the whole value of the brand new vehicle. But I ain't riding around in nothing electric. Because they're dangerous. And see, this is what happens when you ride around and look. Dozens of electric EVs ready to be shipped out to customers went up in flames at the manufacturing facility in Illinois this weekend. The fire broke out at a parking lot late Saturday evening. Thankfully, nobody was injured in the incident. No, 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 no. Nobody was injured yet. But see, your ass will get injured in this incident when you riding around and then it catch on fire. Watch this. I want y'all to see the video. We want to see pretty things. Oh, that's a fire. Oh, Lord, it's a fire. Man, it sound like they shooting, they shooting. What the hell is blowing up like that? Oh, I'm watching a whole fire video. All right, here come that, here come the fire trucks. They're rolling up. Sound like somebody shooting 22. Oh, better lay down, boy. Listen to me when I explain this to you, man. You see, I don't know who decided that, you know, we're going to go to electric vehicles. Let me ask you a question. How many of you guys are taking your gas-powered vehicle and driven it and hit speed bumps, hit curbs, hit went off road and went up the side of a mountain mountain and hit rocks has any of your vehicles ever just caught on fire just boosh flames on fire have you parked your vehicle no 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 let's make it even easier have you went to the gas station and pumped gas right and then your car just caught on fire now to be clear there are videos of people pumping gas on their cell phone and they get a phone call and that little spark catch them fumes and boom. But that's far and few in between. 
But we got plenty of evidence of these calls catching on fire. You won't see? You won't see? Look at this one. Look at this one. And this is what you want us to deal with in America? Look at this. Look at him. On fire. Plugged up to the charging station. I got a neighbor, right? Listen to this. I got a neighbor. You know, he plugs into the charging station. And I be out there smoking my cigars, talking on the phone. You know, running it. You had water. Blah, 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 right? And that bad boy gets the hum and the cuckoo. And I'm sitting there. And I'm saying to myself, I'm saying, Sal, this sound dangerous. Why the car sound like it's having an orgasm? I'm serious. That's what the electric car sound like. It sound like it's having an orgasm all night long. And I don't know if I want to be parked next to no orgasmic car. So I just back up out of there. And I pull around and I get away from it. Because if you're going to have an orgasm, you're going to explode. It ain't going to happen on blow up my car. You're going to blow your damn self up. You see, this is what be happening to these electric cars. Boosh, caught on fire. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's what happened to it. Look at this one. Look at this one. Oh, I wonder if there's statistics on how many people who have died in uh in electric car fires. I wonder if there's any statistics on that. Watch this, watch this. Look, this this somebody rolling in this one. They see me rolling. They hating. Let me read what it say. Guy is driving his Tesla when it just starts on fire. All the doors are locked. Car shuts down. So he has to break the window. Apparently, manual door release wouldn't work. Then it melted to the ground because the lithium battery is burned over at 5,500 degrees Celsius, causing a thermal runway. Yeah, 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 yeah. You better not have none of these calls, man. That's what I'm saying to you. 